Hello guys, I'm back. It's been a minute. I am so excited to be vlogging again. I feel like 2024 is the year of long form content and I'm going to deliver at least four videos a month. You can hold me to that, at least four videos a month. But guys, I have a new little roommate. Everyone, this is Kobe. He's getting so heavy. I got him at 10 pounds, and now he's like 25 pounds. Ooh. Say hello to the vlog, little foofy. Say hello. <laughs> Say hello. Mm. <laughs> he's perfect and love my life. It makes me so happy. He's so precious. And last night I like, fell asleep and I woke up like after an hour, and he was sleeping like above my head. And like cuddling up against my, my head. <sighs> it was so cute. But yeah. That's like really the biggest update is him. It's like 1220. I've been interviewing girls all week for my internship position. Or like intern position. Pretty much they're going to be my content creation assistant. And doing literally like everything with me. Like we will be together a lot. But I'm so excited them and i think it's gonna be a lot of fun it's gonna be a job at the end of the day but i hope they have a lot of fun with me and i think they're gonna help elevate the vlogs too because they can video me and not just be like me always talking to the camera but it can be like them following me so i'm really excited about all things 2024 like the new hires i'm bringing on and yeah i hope you guys had a good New Year's Eve, and we're safe and had a good time. I'm just so grateful to be back. But let's go to, I think it's gonna be my last interview, one of my last interviews for the internship position. Hello. Hey, what is that? Is that the coal? Guys, he likes to take the coal from in the fireplace. Still a kitchen table, but I have the chairs. So I'm just waiting on the chairs. I can put it here. And still no auto furniture. He knows he was bad. That's not to eat. You don't eat coal. No biting. No biting. Here. Guys, he has a Stanley Cup. <laughs> Just fitting that my son has Stanley Cups. And also look at this. Pada. Furberry, like are we kidding? His little Ugg. So funny. He's so cute. Okay, I just got back from my last interview. It's gonna be so hard to pick a girl because every single girl is the cutest girl and I know it'd be such an, a valuable addition to my team and just to helping me. And I just know that it's like I can only pick one. So obviously there's gonna be a bunch of girls who are let down and that just like breaks my heart. But now I'm gonna go inside, take Kobe out to go potty because I'm sure he has to go potty. And then I really wanna relax. I need to edit some things that need to go live soonish. So I need to send them into brands so that they can approve them. I like it on the weirdest eating schedule and like just ate breakfast like an hour ago at like noon. And so I kind of like, I don't know, like I don't know what I'm doing. My, my I feel like my, eating habits this new year have been like so bad and it's just the beginning so perfect perfect and i have no idea what i'm doing tonight we'll just have to see <laughs> i kind of want to go see anyone but you again i saw it already once but i want to see it again anyone but you was the best rom-com i have seen in the longest time like i would put it up there with like the other woman, all the best, like 10 things I hate, 10 things I hate about you, how to lose a guy in 10 days, like up there. It was that good. So if you haven't seen it, go see it. It's seriously that good. Okay, let's go inside and check on Mr. Kobe. Kobe. Should you go potty? Come here, bye boys. Come here. Come here. 
Oh, big stretch. Oh, thank you. Okay, let's go party. Come on. I was editing for like four hours, and now me and Rosie are going for a little run. We're getting her in her runner era. We're starting off light though. We're doing two miles, run, walk. Run, walk. Very light. I can't, I can't run more than five miles without passing out. So. <laughs> we take her on a five mile run to get her to pass out. <laughs> <laughs> Kidding. But then I think we're going to dinner or something. I don't know, we'll just see where the day takes us, where the night takes us. We'll see. Gage, say hello. Hello. I'm a Olipop. Is this Olipop? Yeah, no poppy. Poppy! So good. I love them. Okay, bye. What do you like? Guys, HelloFresh sent me some meals I'm working with them this month on Instagram, I think, or TikTok. So we're making the first meal. I love HelloFresh, I'd be support. It's the steak and shallot sauce. It looks so good, I'm so excited. I'm gonna wash my hands. This cody has been all over my hands. Yeah, for, for washing the produce. Oh, yeah. Washing the produce. Get those clean. <laughs> Finished making it. We did it. Let's do a one bite rating. Okay. <sighs> Start with the steak, yeah? Yes, the best part. Okay. That's mm. so good. We did a good job. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Boom. <laughs> one little hiccup. We messed up the salad dressing just a little bit. We put it on the potatoes <laughs> instead. It was vinegar <laughs> and olive oil on and sugar. <laughs> That was my fault, but it actually tastes fire mm -hmm. with the vinaigrette on it. Might be a little life hack. It's like a little salt and vinegar salt chip. chip. And sugar makes everything taste better, so. Facts. 10 out of 10. It's so good. Cheers. This man has claimed my bed to be his own. And I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad at all. He's so cute. Look at those little eyes. He's like the sweetest thing ever. Oh, yes. He's so sweet. Say hi to the YouTube channel. Hello. <laughs> Good morning, just me and Kobe. He has so much energy this morning, jumping over me. Try and teach him to not jump. But this is the outfit, I'm gonna go running. Lululemon, Lululemon, Lululemon. This little man somehow got out of his crate at like, I don't even know what time it was. It was the morning, but he literally busted out of his crate and then peed on the floor. At least it was on the run. <laughs> but in the morning, he literally just cannot hold his bladder. But yeah, we cleaned it up then took him outside and he finished going potty. I cleaned my bathroom. Oh, okay. Now let's go running. Nope. No. Oh, he thinks that the camera is a, is a toy. It's not a toy. It's not a toy. This is his little puppy blanket and he loves it. He loves it so much. It's the only blanket he's allowed to like chew on, so. Oh, sir, do not bite me. Take that. 
go guys he is teething so bad stop biting me please that hurts please oh no please uh, stop it oh my gosh okay before i start running i'm gonna show you guys my mood board me and my girlfriends had a little mood board night i actually don't even know what this all means i mean like some bit self-explanatory but i more just like picked my favorite photos off pinterest <laughs> that kind of like made sense like i want to play more tennis girlfriends vacation girlfriends pilates eat better work hard let's see this is my model for the year my mantra yeah okay just go back for my run and fed kobe it is hot out there like it's deceiving me like seems like it's gonna be cold and then it's hot guys my tan on my face is like completely gone and it's like a little like this <laughs> because of my trap no one and just washing my face constantly so <sighs> i was like i'm wearing a wetsuit <laughs> a tan i think me and my friend rose and kylie are gonna go for a hike or something get lunch a little later we'll see gage leaves in like 30 minutes back to utah sad we've had fun together even though it's been like chaotic with work this week but i'm happy he was able to come also if anyone's running a marathon this year comment i feel like i should make like a video dedicated to like how to get into running if you wanted to like in 2024 I feel like that'd be a really good video and very helpful for girls who are trying to like get into running this year as one of their like 2024 year goals. Oh, it is so hot. Wow. I ended up ditching this and looping in my sports rock because it was just that hot outside. But let's see Mr. Kobe's eating his food. He literally like. Oh hello. He scarves it down. Man's like a fridge. Puts it away. You can go eat. Go eat. Oh, he just wants loves. And also, he wants to lick my sweaty body. <laughs> you sicko. It's gross. Okay, eat your food. Because I know his dog do that. He loves to shove his head between my legs. Oh, yes. Good boy, Pa. Good boy, Pa. Pa? Pa? Good boy, Pa. He's so good. Except when he jumps and bites. Excuse me, sir. I am actually so freezing from my sweat drying on me, so I'm gonna shower, then bathe, and then I want to do my hair care routine. I will show you what I use because it's been helping my hair grow so much. It's the Care Soft Resistance line. I've been using this first as my first shampoo, second shampoo, and then I'll use the hair mask. And then afterwards, I'll put this on my scalp. It's the Care Soft Serum. I put on my roots, and my hair's been growing like a weed. So. And we just dropped off Gage, so now we're just going to take a little shower and get warm. Oh, sit. Sit. Okay. Okay. You guys are literally stocked on top of three candles and a body oil. <laughs> but now I'm just putting on a little bit of makeup because I'm going for a walk slash hike with my friends. Um, this is the Merit Stick and Shade Scene. I love this stuff because it's very, very natural. And you can layer it to make it like more pigmented. Then I went in with shade Bliss. 
Now I'm gonna top it with peach gasm. I just got this one to try. And I'll say it's just like way less pigmented. I don't think I'm gonna put on mascara because I hate taking off mascara. Hate, hate, hate. Oh, I almost just freaking punctured my eyeball. My friend Kylie is like amazing at makeup. She's the one who put me on the It Cosmetics CC Cream. Seriously, so good. This one is my favorite lip liner. It's so cheap. It's Shade Dearest by Morphe. And I'm not kidding you. It's so good. Okay, I'm gonna use the Kylie Gloss Strip. These are honestly really good. They're really sticky, like to start, and thick, but they last you like all day. Like you barely have to reapply. And I love that about them. Okay, as for my hair, it's like still super wet. So, also this is like my natural hair. It gets super wavy. This isn't even the waviest it gets. But I'm gonna go put on my outfit and I'll come back. Okay, this is the set I'm wearing. I'm obsessed with this aloe set. It really makes the girls girl. I also feel like Meredith Blake in this set and I love it. Me just absolutely destroying any wave I had. by <laughs> brushing my hair out. Ugh. I'm gonna do some braids. Maybe throw on a trucker hat. If you aren't pulling your braids out, what are you doing? Your hair could look so much thicker. Okay, I think we need a little, little trucker hat maybe? I'm thinking yes. Tell me why two braids and a trucker hat is just like a match made in heaven. It's just cute. I'm gonna pull out this piece and this piece. And put on my socks and shoes. Okay. It's me, Rose, and Kylie. Comment your best hiking trails in like North Laguna, Newport, really anywhere in Orange County. Orange County hiking trails, we need the wrecks. Please send all the wrecks. You know what I wanna do? What? Get into like, um, what is it called? Like, like trail biking? Like when you bike on the trails? That would oh be so gosh. scary. That would be so like, scary. But like assisted a little bit, with a little bit of like an assist. Like electric yeah, assist. But I'd be scared of hitting a rock and just flying. Well, that's just the part of the fun. <laughs> <laughs> no risk, no uh, reward. <laughs> so true. Okay. Well, let's go. Also, wait, every single time I've been on a bike, the last, like, mm, let's say two times, got hit by an Uber. And then also an old man collided into me and I had to call the freaking ambulance. Like and you're gonna take your risk on a mountain? <laughs> well, at least, Girl. you know what, yeah. <laughs> yeah I, I, changed my mind. I changed my mind. <laughs> changed my mind. Recording. There we go. Yeah, I need the camera to hear this. <laughs> this coat commands respect. It does. It does. Um, I got back like let's see, probably like two hours ago, and I've just been chilling. Me and Rose and Kylie ate our food, and then they went home, and I just watched the other Zoe. Pretty good. Kind of cheesy, but good. And I think tonight I'm just gonna stay in. Because honestly, I've been feeling like I'm getting a little bit sick. So tonight I'm staying in, but I'm gonna show you guys what I got at the mall. Nothing crazy, just like some basics. I have this brandy shirt in black. 
so I just picked it up in white. And I love the way the black one fits me. Then I got this little like cardigan, which I feel like would be super cute. Just like a classic cardigan. You can have it like unbuttoned or a few buttoned. And then I got these little boxer shorts, which I'm like on a boxer short like kick right now. I think these are so cute. They're kind of like shorter boxer shorts. And I love them. But I might just like watch the movie. It's like 8 p.m. <laughs> and then go to bed. Good morning. It's Sunday. And me and Kobe are just chilling on the bed. I took him out, fed him. And now we're just cuddling on the bed. I have church today. And I think I'm like getting dinner down so I'm coming with some friends. Um, but we'll see. I think it's just gonna be a pretty chill day today. So I also am planning a trip with my friends that I'm really excited about for my birthday. I have this February 12th, but I think we'll do it like the next weekend because it's like President's Day weekend. So I've been like online, like looking at Airbnbs and like resorts potentially. So I'm really excited. Oh yes. Thank you. Okay, no biting. <laughs> He's such a little biter. He's like a little shark. Kobe. Oh, there he goes. He loves to play with this little cinch bag that Way sent him. It came with balls in it, but he prefers the little cinch bag. <laughs> Can you show me bag? <laughs> he loves his bag. He's so funny. Kobe. Come here. the day it is 12 20 i need to leave here at one to go to church and i need to film a little content for tiktok but let's do my makeup together so my makeup has stayed pretty much the same since the last time we talked i am putting on a, oh okay there is nothing worse 
that when the foundation like squirts out and like, oh my gosh, again, on the countertop. And when it gets on the rug, I'm like, are you literally kidding me? So still using the Make by Mario foundation. I use shade 9W. Honestly, this and the Dior Backstage Foundation are super, super similar to me and super great, but I think that this one might be my fave. Now I'm gonna wipe off my lips because they're looking skin color. I'm like, yeah, this is bold of me to put it on a white towel, but it's going in the washer now anyways. Okay, concealer. Actually, okay, let's use, this is kind of new, the LYS um, No Limits Courage. I don't know what color. It says No Limits Courage. The color is either No Limits or it's Courage. <clears throat> Anyways, this stick, I have been loving it because you barely need to put any on. And it's so easy to blend. This is the one that like Meredith uses. Also, found out Meredith is literally younger than me. That woman is so successful. I'm like, okay. She's a baddie. Love her. And we're gonna use this to just <laughs> make my face match my body, specifically my neck. That is disturbing. <clears throat> but you gotta do what you gotta do. And it works. You'll see. Okay, now let's move on to concealer. I love the Make My Mario concealer. I also love the NARS concealer. This one's just like a classic. Okay, blush. I also need to give this a special shout out. This is another foundation that I really like. It's not even foundation, it's CC cream. Love this one. I told you guys about it yesterday. Okay, bliss. We love Rare Beauty Bliss. So that's my first blush I put on. And it's just perfect. It's super natural looking. And then I go in with this one. Shout Tilbury Pinkasm. But I put on a few dots. And it's stunning. Also, I just do not use the Beauty Blender at all anymore. Because I've decided that it just soaks in all the product. And you end up going through your products so much faster. Whereas a brush... You don't need as much product. I need a brush on my eyebrows. Okay, now, this also like is my more makeup look than like everyday makeup look. It's a little bit more from going to church. I'm going to set down here. Really carve out those cheekbones. The reason why I do this is so then I can do like my other powders next. If anything messes up, I'll just brush it off with the powder. Okay. Okie doke. Now I'm going to go in with my powder bronzer. My favorite right now is the House Labs bronzer. Also this brush, amazing. The Patrick Ta Contour 2 for face brush. Phenomenal. Okay, now I'll do my forehead. I saw that self-tanning is out on TikTok, and I personally will not be participating in that trend. I will be self-tanning. Guys, you don't want to see me pale. Trust me, it is it's honestly disturbing. No one wants to see that from me. Okay, now my favorite powder blush. Hourglass Sublime Flush. The makeup artist at the day hair photo shoot put it on me and she said it was her favorite. And I have to agree. It's also my favorite. Now for my favorite highlighter, Rare Beauty Mesmerize. This stuff is crack. It's so good. Okay, now I'm brushing off the powder brows i really like the rare beauty brow stick it's really good does the job my fave lip liner morphe dearest okay then i'm gonna set that with a little bit of powder 
This is Playfully Pink by Kylie. The gloss strip. Mascara with my telescopic. Also, guys, I'm 25. I'm about to turn 26. Can't believe it. I hate getting older. But also, I'm like, I'm so young at heart, so it doesn't really matter. I'm turning 26, and I've never gotten Botox, never gotten a filler, and I feel like pretty soon here, I'm gonna need Botox. Like, okay, I have a lot of movement, like tons of movement, but I don't have any like resting lines yet, <laughs> and I'm really good at using my Tretinoin like every single night, so I think that's why I don't have any lines. But, ugh. I just know it's right around the corner. Obviously, I don't have to get it. No one has to get it, but eventually, I have to get it. I want to get it, I think. I'm actually like, way more hesitant to ever get filler because filler is, like, there's studies now showing that it lasts, like, way longer than you think. And also, like, you can try it. You can use hyaluronidase to dissolve it, but it will leave like a residual 20% still so it's never completely gone and that scares me because what if it's like bad I also had people I know have like oh, reactions like allergic reactions to have to like filler and like it like triggers like an autoimmune disease in them which is super rare like that probably would never happen to like me or but you should never know and I always think less is more when it comes to like your face. I've been trying this Milk Hydro Grip Set and Refresh Spray. I got it in PR and so far I'm loving it. Woo! Next thing you know, Elf's gonna do this. Oh my gosh, guys, have you seen the Elf blushes that are like duped to the Rare Beauty blushes? Don't worry because I bought them in like a million shades so we can review them. Cause I feel like they're literally like I think six dollars or something, and they gotta let the girls know if it's worth it. But from what I've seen on TikTok, they look amazing. Okay, now I need to make a little YouTube, not YouTube, a little TikTok video, and then I'll come back and we'll curl my hair together. Okay, I've heard that like straight hair is like gonna be super in for 2024, so let's just do it. Let's straighten the hair. I actually cannot tell you the last time I just straightened my hair, like just flat iron my hair. If you had curly hair growing up though, you just remember how you would just like straighten the crap out of your hair and just fry it every single morning before school and you try to like straighten out the front pieces and then they were just like absolutely dead. Yeah. Then somehow my hair just relaxed after puberty and now it's pretty manageable. But it's hard to like wear my hair natural unless it's like the summertime. But okay, let's just straighten it. That is just slay. That is so slay. Also, I need to show you Kobe, he's so cute. He loves to wedge himself in like really small spaces <laughs> and then fall asleep. And it's gonna be sad because one day he won't be able to fit behind the bathtub. He won't be able to get there. I think he likes like the cold floor on his belly when he's sleeping. So precious, I can't. Okay guys, hair is herring. I like really want my like really long hair back. And we're getting there. I want it to be like down to here. And if you guys aren't on a scalp like routine, you gotta get on one because it's changing my hair game. This way scalp serum once a day, do it in the morning. And then I've been using and it's literally all gone. It's like not even one use left. The Kerastase Genesis serum. Both are phenomenal. The Genesis one 
my hair sauce is so your hair it prevents hair fallout and the way one is for just like hair growth next i really want to try the neutrophil serum because their pills are great and i feel like their serum would also be great okay haven't seen myself with like stick straight hair in ages the flyaways screaming not okay with those this is a Kerastase elixir ultime oil love this one my hair feels amazing now straight hair is like a sleigh but also it just feels like boring like why does this feel boring to me whatever committed now i feel like it'd be cute to do like a hairstyle where these are like slicked and like under and like slicked and then these are like this is like like out let's do it right now why not i have about five minutes so let's do it okay we're gonna use the finishing gel by Crown Affair because this one will keep my hair clean even though it will be slicking my hair down. Slick her down. Slick her down. Okay, now I'm gonna grab a bore brush. This one's my favorite by MEJ. I think I'm gonna be an offer repeater today. Sue me, okay? Sue me for repeating an outfit. Okay. Hack, use your eyebrow gel and slick down those pieces behind your ear. Look how stupid the back looks. <coughs> screaming, literally screaming. Okay, now it's down. Like, slay. Now I'm going to put in a little bit of texturizing spray. Is this too much for church? Nah, never. Okay, I'm putting on my tights and my dress. I'm wearing like a House of CV dress that is so cute. I wore this like, I think a few weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago. And it's really short, but I feel like when you wear tights, the height doesn't, or like the length of the, sh the dress doesn't matter anymore. Oh, shoot! Just put a huge run on my tights. Good thing I have like four of the pairs. Oh, gotta go. Okay. Nylons are on. Ooh. Okay. I also heard fun tights are in for 2024. So that's fun. Okay. The hardest part about living alone is trying to zip up your dress all by yourself. Let's see, can I do it? Kobe, can you help me? It's all the way down to here. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Okay. Almost. Did it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Then I'm wearing these shoes. This dress. The sleeves are like this. And then I think I'm gonna wear my saddlebag. Guys, I'm looking a little too slave church. Like, I don't know why I'm slaying so hard right now. Not mad though. Okay, let's go to church. Should we go upstairs? Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey, sit. Hey.
okay, I change and fed Kobe, took him out to pee. Now I'm off to hang out with some friends down in San Clemente. I low-key love San Clemente. Like, San Clemente is so underrated. It's so chill. I'd love to live there one day. But, yeah. Let's go down to San Clemente. I think we're in the hot tub. And get dinner. Guys, this company sent me this bikini. And it is the cutest thing ever. It's called 75 and Sunny. I just love the colors of it. And the... Oh, I just think it's so perfect. I love a good bikini. Something about me is I love bikini. And then, can okay, we spend the bottoms? Haven't worn yet. And these are the bottoms. You guys know I love a cheeky bottom. So, I'm excited to wear this today. Even though it's just a hot tub, I love a good bikini. Okay, let's go though. Okay, I just got back from San Clemente and I've been cleaning, made the guest bedroom bed, and then been playing with Kobe and just getting his energy out for bed. And now I'm just gonna take off my makeup and go to bed. <sighs> I'm tired. I'm so tired. Tomorrow my assistant starts, like my intern starts, and I'm super duper excited. I think she's gonna be so helpful for me i am like really sad i have to send out like emails to other girls who didn't get this job but okay there's no but i honestly feel so sad about it just because there were such there were so many great girls and like they all honestly could have done a great job but obviously i can only go with one girl but eventually i might need to hire on more so i'll keep their resumes in my back pocket and their interviews in my back pocket Kobe is like ripping to shreds like a little cardboard like card I gave him. <laughs> I like give him random toys. I'm like, mm, you can rip this up, pick it up later. He doesn't like eat it, he just rips it to shreds and then I pick it up. Anyways, I'm gonna sign off the vlog here. Hope you guys had a great weekend. And I'll see you guys again soon for another vlog. I'm thinking I could do like a few days in my life, or I could just do the weekend vlogs. I feel like it'd be fun to do the few days of my life, but honestly, my weekdays are pretty boring. Like I'm literally just working, but I could also include that, like show you guys what work is like. Um, but it's just me in front of a tripod, pretty much, <laughs> and on a laptop. But yeah, comment what you want from me. I could also do like a QA, I could do get ready with me, I could do a bunch of different things. Oh, not him pulling my swimsuit. Okay, I gotta go, but. I love you guys, and I'll see you definitely next weekend. Say goodnight, Kobe. Good night. Sit. Good boy. Say goodnight.